She had already spent nearly a decade helping to build and maintain Maryland's roads when 46-year-old Sybil DiMaggio left for work on March 22nd. Her husband, George Durham III, recalls the last time he saw her. We woke up Wednesday morning nice and early, and it was uh, coffee, showers, and, you know, breakfast. It was just a Wednesday morning. It was a really good morning, and she popped her head in the shower and gave me the kiss before she walked out. I mean, I can't really ask for much more than that, can I? You know, it was a good morning. That afternoon, Sybil and five other highway construction workers would lose their lives on the Baltimore Beltway after a vehicle crashed into their work site. State leaders marked National Work Zone Awareness Week, urging motorists to remember them through their actions. Slow down, pay attention, and do not forget the Marylanders who every single day are out here trying to make things better for you and your